والذين اتخذوا مسجدا مرارا وكفرا وتفريقا بين المسلمين وارصادا لمن حاول الله ورسوله Boys have convinced me to go on a run with them. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? <laughs> I'm in my comfort zone, don't you worry. <sighs> Tomorrow, I'm gonna get absolutely destroyed with the domes. Slept like a baby, man. Just after waking up, I needed it. I think I went overboard with the amount of food I ordered. <laughs> Back on soon, inshallah. Soon. We share the water. <laughs> yeah, because... <laughs> you know when you're on a run, and you have the water, just... You're holding it, it's just annoying. It's the holder. Yeah. It's the holder, is the issue. But well, he's the one that's going to hold it now. <laughs> someone needs someone to take on for the team. <laughs> I'm not even feeling this run after this sport. Hopefully... Yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. Hopefully after that. Sure, Can't miss it. Yesterday we thought it was Jum'a straight up. We slept in at like six o'clock. I woke up at literally three. Mahmoud was out. He just dodged. Yeah, man, it's power. He dodged. Uh, he actually, dodged. Actually, he actually, didn't actually, even I, wake us up. I actually had to run. He also missed it while he's there. But why did he miss it? It was Thursday, not Friday. That's what happens when you fly to bite your brain starts to fry. Different time zones, different situations. <laughs> Someone's house. All of these brothers are uh, making a move right here. I'm gonna do it with them. Got a surprise visitor. See, with this, you have to press where you're gonna go. It tells you C, C, and then when you go in, there's no button. It takes you directly to the floor you chose. Strange feeling walking into an elevator and not pressing a button. Technically, 80% of your. This is such a. with Abu Bakr, and now. We are headed for iftar, we're invited. No way, look at these. They're giving out these boxes. Brother's fasting as well, and he got one package for himself. He didn't think that we were fasting. <laughs> Second, he found out we were fasting, he gave it to us, and we're like, brother, you're not fasting, because I'm fasting, but I thought you weren't fasting, so he gave it to us, mashallah. Brother, we have to share this, yeah? Okay, yeah, yeah. thank you, brother. No, this is for you. Okay. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Thank you, brother. Recycling outfits and this guy is looking drippy, man. We're gonna match this one again. Shell Karad. Oh, that's nice. Guess where I'm going? Actually, no need to guess. You can probably tell from the tire. I just realized I'm in the wrong terminal. Airport Terminal 1. We made it. I just landed in Riyadh. I'm actually after losing my ihram, so it's good that I'm transiting. I couldn't find the flight straight to Jeddah, but then when I couldn't find my ihram, I was like, that's perfect because I need to wear the ihram from here. Is there a place to buy ihram? Is there a place to buy ihram? No one has the answers. Out of all places, look where I find it. That's my Umrah trip saved. Open the shower for me. Thank you, brother. Okay. So with my previous ihram that I've lost, I got it from Malaysia, but it's like super thick. I don't know why, but it just stays together. It doesn't fall apart. I swear to God, wallahi, in the security control, I nearly went in the nude. Everything fell off, nearly. I grabbed it last minute. No. Thank you very much. Welcome. Got this coffee in Riyadh. I made a promise that I'm going to be consistent with the vlogs in Ramadan, and I'm literally editing the vlog of my ihram. It's supposed to the first vlog of Ramadan. Let's go. Oh, it's secure again. My thing nearly fell. My thing nearly fell. But why this is so bad? I need to find the solution. B one zero five So they just told us we're passing by the Miqat, the Haram zone. So this is where you make the dua. The big 
Last time I came here, I had to wait. I mean, wait in passport control because everyone's flying internationally. But this is actually a deadly hack. I came transit, got into the yard real quick, barely anybody at passport control. And now I'm going straight to baggage and then I'm out. If you see the other side here, there's just a sea of people. And that's just to get their bags. And then there's going to be a sea of people at passport control. So it's at least an hour an hour and a half to get through that whole system so that's how much it took me and that was before i'm online so i can only imagine what it's like now like i can see it's packed for me look empty because we came in domestically every time i see my luggage now it's a beautiful sight i used to take this for granted <laughs> right little tip when you come out there's gonna be a thousand people jumping at you trying to get you a taxi they're like taxi 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 if you go downstairs, there's a free bus if you have a tourist e visa straight to the harbor. I spoke too soon. They only operate from 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. Okay, I just booked the train ticket. Let's say the train's gonna depart at 1.35. You're booking your train on the application at 1.25. It will take your money, but it won't give you a booking. So it just took my money there. And then obviously because it's so packed, they're like, listen, there's nothing we could do or you could wait. So I booked the wrong train twice. That's how sleep deprived I am. It's another hour and a half to my train. 3.35, that's when my train is. We're through. <laughs> I'm gonna have half an hour to get so hold it. So Quran Bismillah Rahman Rahim Coach Ten Limaniya Pijita Mutamanida Nakum Rihla Tan Saida Do you fun al Kiram Nastimi Ul An Ila Duha is Sufar وهو من الأدعية التي كان يدعو بها رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم. No, half an hour to sahur. Half an hour left. Fajr Adhan is about to come in. I'm so thirsty. Today is going to be a long day because I just didn't have some. I'm gonna be thirsty today. I'm gonna be thirsty. I'm coming in with the bag. No time to go back to the hotel. I'm going to pray Fajr, go back to the hotel, throw the bag, then come back. I'm not gonna sleep. I think I'm just gonna pull an all night. See, this door is a direct access to the camera. Let's get to the hotel now. I'm not staying in the clock tower this time. Way out my budget. Look at the sea of people. This is insane. I am going so far away from Maharam. I've booked in a place called the Lazizi. It's a bit further out. 10 minute drive. But you know what, for me, I'm not even going to spend time in the hotel anyways. I'm just going to throw my luggage and I'm going to spend all my time in the Haram. So I came to the wrong side. The bus is on the other side, Safa Al Marwa side. Back into the mess. Hey, I was like, uh, holiday suites, uh, LSEZ. He goes, I was like, why? He's like, you're going to have to go back in there. To be honest, I don't mind it too much. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm walking slow. People are actually not that bad. Especially when you have a bag, you have some space because it's like an extra person beside you. And you're just making dhikr, taking it easy. A light survive. The only thing is I'm a bit hungry, I'm a bit thirsty. Like I'm very thirsty. I was dying to drink water from Riyadh. Other than that, there's no rush. Take our time with this thing. We're here. Like this act in itself is still a ibadah. <laughs> <laughs> Will I be able to get in? That was short lived. I wanted to leave my luggage and go finish my amma, but I have to sleep. There's our hotel, holiday in. You're not gonna use that, brother. You're gonna shave bald, man. <laughs> yeah, this hotel's a vibe. I recommend this place. Hotel in La Zizia. It's a bit further out, but it's cheaper and it's just high quality i was just in the clock tower on my last amara trip like a week and a half ago this place is 10 times better i'd rather stay in this place than the other place but the best thing about the clock tower though is the location go down you're at the haram straight away 
But cleanliness, they're too complacent. They know they're gonna get the customer no matter what. After him didn't pull the trigger and go involved, but Ahmed uh, is involved. Bush is actually nice and comfortable, but it takes his time to actually move. <laughs> So it's obviously so packed, they've blocked the Sahan area. So I'm trying to find a way to make it into the main spot. If not, I'm just going to wait because I don't want to do my Umrah on the third floor. Right, I think we managed to find a way straight into the Haram. <laughs> Alhamdulillah, I didn't settle. I was going to settle to do it in the second floor or the third floor because they were blocking it off. Then I was like, you know what, let me get out of here and go the other way. And now, Alhamdulillah, I think it's open. This section is locked over here, but they've just opened this part in here straight into the Sahan. Alhamdulillah, I actually got in. Shukran, Rahim, Shukran. Allah, Yarham, Waldeek, Barakallahu Fiq. Rambana, Atina, Fi Dunya, Hasana. <laughs> this kid just <laughs> <hit> the, <black laughs> the water is so close yet so far. Good man passed me on some Zimzam. Happy days. Yes. I'm not gonna get involved in that. It's too much. You're gonna ruin your amra, I swear. Everyone's just killing each other. Okay, brother. For you. Downstairs is packed, so they forced us to go upstairs. I don't mind going upstairs, it's my first time doing it. on random buses at this point it's not even going to my hotel but i'm just hopping on it getting out of this area because it's so packed and then i get a taxi from wherever i am <laughs> where am i going i'm just floating about you made it after 40 minutes of walking my trusty cat trick the new anaka Bruv, wallahi, the quality, this is different. Oh man, you can't see it properly, but it feels so premium. Allah my back, Allah my back, Allah my back. Don't lie to you, I put on the stove expecting it to be exactly like all the other thobes from before in terms of like quality. But the way you just sat on me, it's perfect, Allah my back. I'm actually so gassed. Now I actually have a proper thobe to wear for Amma. I've never had this place and then I walked in and I was like, oh, this design looks familiar. These brothers, they ain't waiting for They got cracking with my food straight away. Nah, your food is coming. Saha, saha. Got a food coma. You got another 15. Alhamdulillah. Natural progression. Straight for a gahwa. For a coffee. Who cares, bro? Let's get a double espresso. I'm bro. I'm here trying to find a white foam for the handmade piece that Anaka has. I don't like to wear it just like that by itself. I like to wear it with a kind of just a white plain film. Look at the quality between this and this stuff. Yeah. Once you go Anaka, you can't go back. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing really here. I just want something plain, bro. I just want plain white. 
أكيد ما في. I got some trousers. We're getting one of these sajedas that convert into a chair. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Just after leaving the bus. Look, look at this. The buses are all the way there. The buses keep going. They don't end. These two Libyan lads, they actually motivated us to get out of the bus. They're like, listen, get out. You're going to be here until Shuruf time. Let's move. I put on Google Maps and it was like one hour and a half. And they were like, listen, come through our way. And it's gonna be like less than half an hour. But you need to walk fast. So these lads that are on the bus right now that are waiting, they're not gonna make it for Fajr. And we're one hour early as well. They're just chilling, they know they're going nowhere. <laughs> There's some bus running through that tunnel, I'm not gonna lie to you. I feel sorry for the people that are on the bus, they're trapped. Even if they wanna make a move now, that's it, they're missing it. There's no way they make it on time. I said I would've made it in time. If I actually walk, but there's a bit of a buzz also to one. I'm actually not out of breath like that, and I'm not sweating probably. But there's so many buses. This is something for you to know. If you're not going to be in the clock tower and you're going to get somewhere further out, then you need to come early to these things, man. But look at the buses here. Insane. Like this place is stacked with buses. Look, everyone. A lot of these buses are full. So many people. I need to get some Zems and more into me because I told the lads, I was like, listen. Bring a bottle of wine. They're like, nah, we don't even need it, bro. The Zemzem are gonna be there. I'm like, halas, you wanna fight war over Zemzem? Then let's do it. <laughs> Little do we know, we're gonna be jogging. I don't know where they are as well. They're gone. They're somewhere all the way in the back. I kinda got a bit too carried away. I was walking fast at the start and I was like, you know what? Seeing people jogging, I'm like, let me just do it as well. Maybe get some time to actually get a few sips in. A few Zemzem sips. What are you checking? <laughs> He's checking my location. But I'm too quick for you, fam. <laughs> 15 more minutes until Fajr. Where the, where's the water at, boys? Ah, Alhamdulillah. Get to the Mayid Zamzam. Where the Mayid Zamzam? Man, I'm going to the Mayid Zamzam. And you run. This is the Kilab. This is the Kilab. Yesterday, I didn't drink any water for Sahara. And then I actually went to my Umrah. And it was a five hour Umrah. But Subhanallah, there's blessings and barakah now. I didn't even feed it. I didn't even feel the thirst. Look, I'm not trying to be in the same position, to be honest. And then saying, as in, he has the sabab. And then, afterwards, he talk about Allah. He talk about Allah. There's a sea of people, man. I've never been to an Umrah in which it was this packed. So many humans from all sides of the planet. The Kazakhstani, the Uzbek, the Nigerian, the Libyan. There's a lot of Libyans there, I'm surprised. My Libyan brothers are representing. They're actually given access, they were given the visa, they were given the e-visa, usually they're always rejected. We have six more minutes to get water. Yeah, load up on the water, Allah yarham waldeek. But it's looking after us, bismillah. What a gent, he was serving everyone up. Do you know what I realized as well? I just bought a sajada, a prayer mat, and I forgot it. One of these foldable ones. here two years ago these toilets were a mess homeless people sleep in it actually someone sleeping here but as I like inside the toilets it was bad I left the coming from Aftar and I'm going through the media I'm looking at the Lebanon trip I'm looking at the Togo trip and then I go to the Pakistan trip and the whole files disappeared it disappears from here disappears from this disappears from all the cards why well, they're gonna have to send my cards to the technician or maybe it's still in a folder somewhere that I just don't know but I have everything labeled according to dates and that one is just not there whole three days of machine work stomach bug right off it's probably one of the worst feelings